All right, this is Sean Foster SC Mods here, and I'm going to go over uh, installation of the sound tube for a 15 to 19 uh, Mustang GT Kenny Bell setup. Difference with the Kenny Bell setup is the Kenny Bell has the uh, rear inlet. Uh, that design uh, does kind of impede getting into the firewall uh, from the engine base side without taking the supercharger off. So I made a, an adjustment to the Kenny Bell kit to be able to um, install it and slide it in from inside the vehicle um, through the grommet inside and to have the sound tube come out um, through the engine, uh, engine base side. So let's pretend this is the engine base side here. This is inside the vehicle, the firewall. This, the, the hole comes out near the foot pedals. Um, this right here is a small mock-up of the uh, sound tube itself. This, por this portion here is realistic in size. This here would be probably uh, about another 30 inches long. So this is a short piece, but it is the same diameter. And what I'm going to show you is how this slides through from the inside so you don't have to try to reach through the engine base side with the large Kenny Bell rear inlet that comes over and it just doesn't allow you to really get good access. So uh, as usual, uh, I like to use grease on the parts when we're trying to uh, get these. Uh, anytime you're pushing through a grommet uh, or if you're connecting the sound tube to uh, uh, into a grommet or into the hose itself, the sound tube itself. So I'm just going to put some inside here as well. And I'm going to show you how well this slides through. So what you're going to do is once this is pushed through, you're going to end up uh, being able to reach in from the engine side and grab the sound tube that's pushed through. And then you're going to be able to connect it to the inlet uh, on the other side. So basically, you're going to feed this in. So like this here and once it gets to the expanded part I've narrowed it down and you're just gonna push a little harder and look at that it goes right in now I keep a I keep a zip tie on the side on the end here to give you an idea about about how deep to go and uh, that's good enough right there it exposes about an inch and a quarter of the sound tube um, on the other side, and then we're going to use the diaphragm cap. Diaphragm cap for the larger uh, portion here of, this, of the uh, end of the sound tube is uh, it's got a, a metal fitting on the end pipe, and uh, you can just grease it a little bit, make it slide in there. It's a nice airtight fit. Once it goes in there, boom, all set. So that's basically it. The Kenny Bell uh, setup uh, installed through the firewall. Once this end is uh, through on the other side, you're gonna you're gonna grab this, pull it up, and then you're gonna install the other end here into the inlet pipe. Again, this is just a mock-up. This end portion here is not the actual size, so just keep that in mind. All right.